Welcome to Married to Portuguese. On each episode, my English-Irish husband, Bob, and I discuss and laugh about our life and adventures in the Portuguese culture. Bom dia. Bom dia. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello, everybody. Hi, everyone. Well, this is our last day in Furnish at Terra Nostra Hotel. One of my favorite places ever. Just my favorite. Yeah. Um, we had to show you what our view was every morning when we looked out our our window and here it is yeah it's, it's just gorgeous beautiful just gorgeous. trees we're going to film in the garden but it rained last night so yes. there's a lot of dripping and wet yes. and mud yes. so we're doing this from, from our, our room, room. <laughs> so welcome to that well the second half of the trip um, in the last episode we were talking about uh, the first half and we had just gotten here to terra nostra yes yeah and so we've had uh, a lovely two or three days visiting the grounds and moving around. And moving around, going into um, the different little villages and uh, Maya, and which we love Maya. I think every time, every village we go into, we leave and we go, oh, I love this village. Yeah, that's <laughs> and beautiful. The consensus is, uh, once again, from everyone traveling with us, uh, how much they love the island. And <laughs> so many of them are like, how much, do, how much do houses cost? How can I move here? How can I make this work here? So, and there are some uh, single women that are part of our, our tour and they're all like, ooh, the men are so handsome here. <laughs> so there are people, uh, you know, looking to find a, a special Portuguese man and uh, stay here kind of thing. Um, so it's been very cute. It's very, very cute. Um, we've had a lot of um, families like moms and daughters together. Mm -hmm. um, I, we get a lot of that in our tour. And I specifically, I personally, um, I love that. I love the, uh, the mom and daughter bonding and coming here to this island, spending their time together with me and all that. And I get to be a part of it, you know, is... Yeah. It's yeah. just really special. Yeah, so. we've got singles, we have couples, we have sisters, we have uh, brothers-in-law, we have yeah. uh, every single, combination. Single people. Yeah, yep. I mentioned singles. Yeah, yeah. So singles. Everybody's welcome. There's a seat for everybody there on is. this table. There is. And at the end, it all becomes one big family. And what I loved hearing the most, um, you know, was saying to me, you know, this, this couple especially um, said to me, you know, we came here not knowing what we were going to, um, you know, to find. They had never been on a tour before. Uh, they've always done things alone as a couple. And, and now that they've done this tour, they're like, I felt like I traveled with family. Hmm. And, and that is, I, I can't get any better than that. We really can't hear no. anything better than that. Because when you're with us and you're here, you're part of our family. That, I mean, that's that's just it. Mm -hmm. And um, it, it just is. It just is. And that's the feeling that I want everyone to have when they're here is that they belong. They belong. And um, so, yeah, that was that was very sweet. I'm getting a little melancholy now because we're coming to the end of everything and saying our goodbyes to people. And that's always hard to do. Yeah, it sure always, is. Yeah, it's really hard to do. Because, again, people are going to Hawaii, even though we've got a place to stay. If we where ever, they live, they're going back to Hawaii. Yeah, where yeah. they're going back to where they live. Uh, and we know we have a place to stay if we ever go to Hawaii. Mm -hmm. That's a, that's a no-brainer. And then uh, people going back to Seattle and people going back to the South and people going back. I mean, again, we're they're everywhere in the U.S. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, it's... And for a moment we were all together here in the Azores and that is special memories yeah. that will never be forgotten. So. Yeah, I mean, you quickly become friends because you know, you're spending 12 hours a day, 14 hours a day yeah. together, yeah. doing things and being together, involved. As a, fam and as a family, because yeah. that's how I- Eating, traveling. That's how I treat everyone. I'm the, yeah. the mother hen and everyone is my little chickies. And uh, so, yeah, I'm very protective. <laughs> yeah, you know, which, some of the highlights the last couple of days, uh, you, you mentioned Maya before when we were at uh, Femme de Secula. Femme de, Femme de Secula. No? Yes. That was terrific where we had the traditional yes, the, traditional meal. Yeah. And, uh, you know, the chef uh, Leitz is, um, again, everywhere we go, um, I have somewhat of a connection to it. And um, I don't go in it um, blindly. 
It's uh, hmm. everything has been checked and rechecked, and I go in to make sure. Before there was one restaurant we went to, and the gentleman was like, "Oh, you know, we can do this for you, we can do that for you," and I'm like, "My husband and I have been here." A few times so we know what you're capable of doing and they're like oh my goodness I thought this was your first time here I'm like no 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 uh, it's not random places that we go to they're specific yeah, places they really are our favorite places they really are our favorite We're places yeah bringing 30 of our closest friends with us yes and, yes and having fun and yeah it was fun even just locally here and and furnish and showing everybody the the hot springs in the middle of town yes, and warning yes. them don't touch because you don't will touch. <laughs> you will scald yourself yeah and, and once again that was um yeah for everybody it was like oh my goodness you know with thermal st i mean steam and you know pressure cooker you know the whole the whole thing about the cuisine the traditional thing but that's our last meal it's always the last meal for me is the cuisine um we can hear people around us they're starting to wake up <laughs> so i don't know if we've woken them up or not i thought no. i thought we've been talking really quietly but I, I can hear people now going into their balconies. It's fine. <laughs> I don't want to interrupt. We are not interrupting. Yeah, so, um, but I mean, what was your highlight? What was your highlight of the trip? So, of the whole trip, and not to be corny, it's the people we traveled with. Yeah. Really because is. these are our favorite places. There were one or two that we were discovering for the first time, yeah. but to visit the other places and see how much everybody else enjoys them as well, yeah. is it's really rewarding for us. Like. We're not crazy. These really are great places yeah. and, and great people. So it was, it was the, the tour group for me. Yeah, the tour group. Yeah, what yeah. about you? Well, How do you top that, by the way? Well, the <laughs> thing is, is I've been here now several times with different groups, and each group has been incredible. Oh, yeah, 100%. Incredible. Um, you know, for many of them, I keep in contact with them. They keep in contact with me. It continues. Um, and we have a lot more in common. <laughs> they get to know, <laughs> we get to know each other a lot more. And I, I have to say, I have been blessed. I really have. I've been blessed with the, the people that have joined us. And, uh, and I'll stick with it. Foodies are a special breed of people. And, um, because we, we enjoy life, that's for sure. Yeah, but I mean, there were highlights that I know the group really liked when we stopped at a farm. Yeah, that was that, that was, was tremendous. For them. And uh, God, I just blanked on the other. We just did it in the last day or so. Um, yeah, we're tired. <laughs> we're, we're, it's, we're tired, and I'm starting to lose my voice. And that's when I know that the tour is about to end. Is when my voice starts yeah. leaving me. <laughs> yeah, but I'd say the activities where we get to, to do things that yeah. folks don't normally normally get to yeah. do. Yeah, and then when we get to Furnish, we try to relax, mm -hmm. you know, as much as we can. But um, but yeah, no, we yeah, last night was our full, uh, our very last night was last night, and uh, it was very heartwarming. Um, it was almost like I was saying. We were saying our goodbyes last night to each other because in, today at the airport and all that we don't want to we don't want to do that. Sure. So our goodbyes were last night. I never went to camp as a kid, but this must be what it be like what at if, the end yeah, of summer when you have to say yeah, goodbye. goodbye. And it's goodbye to all our new friends. And it's um, it yeah it was very it was very touching. It was very heartwarming, and hearing um, you know people who are not even Portuguese on how much they felt like they were at home, and um, and how they felt like I. Like, we're family. We're just family now. That's it. Yeah. End of story. And it's funny, there are a few people who were on the trip who were not fans of yours. No, they, they didn't They were even... just in the right place at the right time, no. wanted to go on a tour, and this had opened up, and they yeah. and they jumped in. Yeah. And they're fans now. They're fans now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they are. <laughs> so that was, that was fun. That was fun to get to, yeah. to know those folks and yeah. people who'd seen... Uh, you know, season one, and uh, wanted to relive some of the experiences when you were filming. Yes. Here on Sao Miguel. Yes. That was yes. fun, and the people who uh, watch this podcast and yeah. know us from that. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. hey, you really do talk this way to each other. <laughs> really yes, this is. Yep, this is us. This is us. This is us. So yes, that's so that's no, wonderful. It's, um, I can't say it enough. I can't say it enough. 
<clears throat> and I say this all the time, I am very grateful for what I do. Mm -hmm. Very grateful. Um, it is, uh, who would have known that, you know, in my 50s, I would have written a book and that book has taken me to places I never thought I would go. And, and it continues taking me to places and doing things that, uh, that I love and, um, and I'm passionate about. So, and that I have this gentleman here next to me. I guess that's me. That's you, <laughs> who, uh, who encouraged me all along the way. So, and I know this is your podcast. This is my podcast. It is. This is your podcast. But I need to say that about you. Well, thank you. Yeah, I, I need to say that about you. Thank me. you. I appreciate that. Um, you know, I think overall we were very lucky with the weather. I mean, yeah. we had rain overnight last night. Yes. And then but look at occasionally there was yeah. a sprinkle. Mm -hmm. Um, but the weather weather held out. And yes, it did. Let us do most of. Yes, the, they really know, there did. Was, there was one Miradura, one lookout where yep. it was just <laughs> windy and misty. And we didn't stay and there that long. I think everybody was happy to flee. Yes, flee but besides the, that, everything bus. else was great. Yeah, yeah. Food was great, and knock on wood, we're going home with as many people as we arrived <laughs> with. Basically, yes, yes. I say basically. Yes. Um, so that's. So that's pretty good. Yeah. And uh, there were a lot of smiles last night. Oh, yeah. A lot of tears, too. No one, like, there were plenty of people like, do we have to go? <laughs> yeah, it's nice. That, you Can know, we stay longer? <laughs> the camaraderie and the surroundings yeah. and, you know, the places that we go into. We know the restaurant owners or the farmers. We know the, we we know know the people them. we're visiting. We know all of so, them. you know, our guests are greeted as family just as. We are. Maria, some people said they were, they felt like they were treated like VIPs or family when we, <laughs> we showed up, but that's yeah. the way, that's they, the way you're greeted, so. But that's the way, that's the way I want everyone to feel. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. I want everyone to feel that. So. That's really fun. So we've got a little bit of time to spend this morning packing, getting yeah. ready to go, and then we yeah. get the flight back to Boston this afternoon. So knock on wood that the weather stays. Beautiful like this. Know, like this. Yeah. And, Everybody gets home safely. Yeah. So the next time we'll talk to you, we will be back in the U.S. Back in the United States. Yes. Yeah. So until then. Yeah. Talog. Talog. All right. Tal bye bye. Thanks, everybody. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and we'd love to hear your ideas for topics. Ciao.